Namaste yogis. Welcome back to Yoga with Nelly. Today I'm going to show you a short practice just to build up strength for your body and also burn fat. If you don't have much time for a longer practice like 30 minutes or an hour, then just 5 or 10 minutes a day also good enough for your body but make it a good habit. All right, so let's get on your mat and let's get started. So come into high plank. Maybe bring your feet wide to the outside of the mat. It helps with your balance. And hold on here. So make sure that your shoulders are over your wrist. And then engage your core. And squeeze your glutes here. Good. Activate your legs here. And then you can start to tap your opposite shoulder. Around 10 or 20. And then stop here. Take a rest. And then shift your hips back. Come into wide leg downward facing dog. And then from here, tap your opposite toes. Or if you cannot reach it, maybe your opposite knee. Maybe shift your body forward when you come over and then shift it back when you touch. So it's a combination between plank and a twist. Inhale when you come to plank. Exhale when you twist. All right, come back to plank here. Okay, now we start with the modified push-up. So leave your feet off the mat. Maybe cross your ankles here. And then shift your body forward, activate your core. Come all the way down. And then inhale, pushing back up. Good. Just like that. Inhale up. Good. Exhale down. Breathe in. Breathe out. So make sure that you hug your elbows into your rib cage. And activate your core. During your moving, breathe out. So also five or ten rounds, and then shift your hips back. Come into child's pose. So rest here for a few breaths. And then slowly come up. And now we start another practice is for core strength here. So come down on your back, interlace your hand behind your head. Good. And now bend your legs. Okay, so now we bring our right elbow to the opposite knee and straight your right leg. Come back to the left. All right, slow 
slowly come back here. Now we come into bridge pose. Bring your heels to your hips here. Feet hip distance, palms by your side here. And then inhale, lift, standing your hips up. Squeeze your glutes here, exhale down. Inhale, lift, exhale. Pressing down to your feet and squeeze your glutes. One more here, exhale, release. Beautiful, hug your knees into your chest here. Now start to rock your body up and down three times and then come into sit position with the both poles. Let's go. One, two, three. All right, activate your core. Good, maybe bend your knees or straight your legs, whatever you feel comfortable with. Good, finding your balance. Activate your core here, and then maybe float your arms out. Breathe in, breathe out. And hold on here. Breathe. Beautiful job. Good. Exhale. Cross your legs, and then hug your knees in. Yes. Good. All right, so now, Let's stretch our body a little bit. Bend your left leg in front. Or straight your right leg behind. Make sure your hips are even here. Stay here, breathe in and breathe out. Maybe if you want, you can bring your chest down to the floor. Forehead down. Come into slipping pigeon. And stay here for a few breaths. And then slowly walk your hands back up. Good. And then turn your body to the right. Bend your right leg and stray your left leg behind. Bring your hips to even. Few breaths here. Reaching your chest forward. And then slowly lengthen your spine. Bring your chest down, forehead down to the floor. Also stay here for a few breaths. And then slowly walk your hands back up. Exhale. Come back to seated position. All right, so thank you for spending a few, only a few minutes here to build up the good habits for your body. Hope you feel good in your body right now and I'll see you in the next video. Namaste.